Hello kids, how are you today? Happy Easter! Today we have a special class about Easter. Do you know what, what is the meaning of Easter? Yeah? Semana Santa, chicos, Pascua, okay? So today we are going to do a lot of things. The first thing we are going to learn vocabulary about Easter, okay? We will review the beats together and I will send the beats to your parents. Voy a mandar los beats a los papás para que los podáis repasar también. Yeah? And after that, we are going to do crafts. Okay, manualidades, chicos. Después de repasar los beats, os contaré qué manualidades vamos a hacer y qué es lo que necesitáis. Super, super easy. Okay? Yeah? Are you ready? Now, let's see the vocabulary about Easter. Super, super easy. Okay? Yeah? Ready? Well, the most important thing in Easter is chocolate okay chocolate okay because in easter we have the easter bunny el conejito de pascua who bring us chocolate eggs okay yeah rabbit okay i i'm sure that probably you know this this word esta palabra ya la sabéis segurísimo rabbit Okay, very easy, rabbit. Candy, candy or candies, okay? Caramelos, dulces, chicos, candy, very good now. Egg, we will see later why is so important eggs, or why are eggs so important during Easter, okay? So, flower, flower. Why are we learning these? Because we normally celebrate Easter during spring, okay? Spring, primavera, and in spring we have flowers. The Easter bunny, the Easter bunny, el conejito de Pascua, chicos, el conejito de Pascua. Recordad decirles a los papás que tienen que abrir una puerta para que entre en casa, okay? The Easter bunny. Easter egg. Os voy a dar una pista. Esto tiene algo que ver con lo que haremos después. ¿Ok? Easter egg. Basket. Basket. Why are we learning basket? Because in the basket we normally have the Easter eggs. ¿Ok? Decorate. Decorate. Because during Easter we decorate eggs. Decoramos los huevos de Pascua. Giving, okay, we give, damos, we give Easter eggs, okay? Spring, spring, okay, because we normally celebrate Easter during spring. Hide, what is the name of hide? Hide, what is he doing? He's hiding, se está escondiendo. Because in Easter, the Easter bunny hides the Easter eggs. Okay? Yeah. Hand. Hand. Because during Easter, we should hand, tenemos que buscar the Easter eggs. Los huevos de Pascua, chicos. Okay? Let's review very, very quickly. Now, chocolate. Rub it. Candy, egg, flower, Easter bunny, Easter egg, basket, decorate, given, okay, given, spring, spring. Hide, okay, like hide and seek. What is going to Hide and seek. Hand. Good? Yeah? Okay, so do you know why we decorate eggs and we like uh, hide chocolate eggs during Easter? ¿Sabes por qué decoramos huevos de Pascua y por qué viene el conejo de Pascua? You know why? Well, the thing is that um, Easter is at the end of Lent. Lent Cuaresma, chicos. No nos vamos a meter mucho en esto de la cuaresma para vosotros. But the thing is that
that after this period, normally people used to keep eggs, solían guardar los huevos, okay, and because they couldn't eat eggs, no podían comer huevos ni productos lácteos que vinieran de los animales. So we started again eating eggs and milk at the end of Lent, al final de la cuaresma. ¿Qué pasaba? Que Pascua, Easter, era un momento de celebración. And they used to decorate, solían decorar los huevos, y los escondían y los regalaban. That's what we are going to do today, okay? We are going to do two crafts. You want to know what are we going to do, yeah? Okay, the first thing. Of course, we are going to decorate an Easter egg. Vamos a decorar un huevo de Pascua. Look. This is a real egg, okay? And, but you have to empty it. Tenéis que vaciarlo, chicos. ¿Cómo lo hacemos? Look, we made two holes. One here and one down here, okay? Once you have the two holes, una vez tenéis los dos agujeros, you have to blow. Like this, okay? You have to blow to let the egg go through this hole, okay? And now we have an empty egg, okay? So what else do we need? We need a brush, okay? Un pincel. And of course, we need paintings, okay? Paintings, pinturas. We will see later, okay? And what's the other thing we are going to do? Mm -hmm. We are going to make secret Napkins. Do you know what a secret napkin is? No? You want to see? Okay, you only need napkins and markers. Rotus. Napkins, servilletas de papel and markers. Okay? Let's go! Ready? Come on! Hello kids! How are you? Okay, so we are here ready to start painting our egg. The first thing you should do is design your egg. Vamos a diseñar nuestro huevo, okay? So, of course, our egg is going to be blue because the eye kids is blue. And I thought that maybe we can draw like yellow lines and orange circles, okay? So, once you have your design, una vez tenéis vuestro diseño, we need the egg, okay? Remember that you should empty, okay? Tenéis que vaciarlo, chicos. As I told you, mm, bueno, como veis ya ha empezado, <laughs> eh, because I wanted to try how was like the blue. Um, so, to empty your egg, you should make two holes, one and two, okay? Blow through this one. Tenéis que soplar por este. Y así por aquí saldrá el huevo. So my egg is already empty, okay? And I'm going to paint it the whole egg blue. Voy a pintarlo todo de azul. Once uh, it is dry, una vez haya secado, I'm going to decorate it, yeah? Now, are you ready? Cool, let's go. How are you? Okay, so we already have our Easter egg ready. Now it's drying. And now we are going to make our magic napkins. Nuestras servilletas mágicas, okay? So for the magic napkins, you only need like a paper, like a napkin, napkin paper, una servilleta de papel, okay? And markers. So you should fold your napkin, tenéis que doblar la servilleta en dos, you see? So now, this is your napkin and we have folded it, ok? La hemos doblado. Now, inside, dentro, vamos a hacer un dibujo. We are going to draw something, ok? With our markers. Yeah? I already made it, yo ya he hecho uno. So this is my napkin, ok? And I draw a flower, okay? An Easter flower. So you should trace it, tenéis que repasarla, and color it. And outside, en la parte de fuera, 
you can see that our flower is the same flower, but just with the black, okay? Solo con el negro. We haven't colored it. No la hemos coloreado. Ok, so, vamos a repasar. The napkin, tenemos nuestra servilleta. Folded, doblada. Inside, our drawing with colors. Nuestro dibujo con colores. And outside, our drawing without colors. Nuestro dibujo sin colores. Yeah? Aha. Now, we need a plate, un plato. And water, okay? Ready? Water. Ready? Let's see if it works. Vamos a ver si funciona, chicos. ¿Preparados? Let's see. Wow! Look at this! It's a magic napkin. Woohoo! Great! ¿Veis cómo han salido todos los colores que teníamos dentro? Es magia. Cool. So, we can make another one. ¿Queréis que hagamos otra? Yes or no? Yeah? Okay, let's make another one. Cool, we are back. So, we are going to do another one. We add more water. Maybe we can add a little bit less. Vamos a añadir un poquito menos. Vamos a ver qué tal sale sin tanta agua. Yeah? Okay, it's a good idea if you prepare a big plate so you have enough space for your napkin, ¿vale? Now, tin tin, we have an Easter egg, but it, we, we don't have colors. So let's see, what do we have? Ready? One, two, three. Wow, look at this. This is our Easter egg. Wow, but in a napkin. Cool, isn't it? Habéis visto que chulada? So we can, this is very easy because I'm sure that at home you, you have like these paper napkins, seguro que tenéis estas servilletas de papel, and markers, and you can make a lot of things. Podéis hacer muchas cosas, chicos. Podéis hacer lo, el vocabulario que hemos revisado de Easter, ¿vale? So, I hope you have enjoyed our class, and I hope you will enjoy your Easter. Bye, bye. See you in the next class.